Thank you very much. I'd like to uh, really uh, tell the board how much I appreciate this and to say that I'm really here along with the other members of my advocacy committee, Anne and Neil, back there doing uh, ongoing wonderful uh, work advocating for, for ALS. And, uh, so I am proud to be here, to be, uh, to be the representative from that uh, group, and uh, particularly pleased to be here with the leaders of tomorrow. It uh, was back in 2007 when our family uh, received the news that my husband George was diagnosed with ALS, and as our life was spinning out of control, the wonderful ALS Society, volunteers, Ellen Mahoney, uh, everyone involved came into our life and helped us. I'm here tonight with my son Jason, and all of our family are so appreciative of the work that the ALS Society did for us that I felt if there was some teeny tiny way that I could pay back, uh, I would get involved and uh, help volunteer. So it's through that that I've been able to be involved in the advocacy committee. Uh, I do happen to know those characters down at the legislature, <laughs> and uh, I know uh, how to, to speak to them, and uh, I know that our work has made a difference. And uh, regardless of uh, what happens on uh, May the 9th, uh, and whatever party is going to be coming into the legislature in British Columbia, we know that those who are currently sitting as MLAs know about ALS, uh, know our needs, and know about the work of the ALS Society. So I'm just uh, so honored to be uh, giving this award tonight. Thank you very much.